Since the tagline on the poster for this movie is This Summer Go Blonde, and I adore uh, uh, Elsa Blonde hair, uh, I'm going blonde for this review. <laughs> Legally Blonde, directed by Robert Lutzik and uh, written by uh, Karen McCullough, Lutz and uh, Kirsten Smith and based on the novel of the same name, uh, which after this movie I can't uh, uh, freaking wait uh, to uh, have a read. So Legally Blonde tells the wonderful and meaningful story of uh, fashion merchandising high class uh, uh, straight A student Elle Woods, uh, played by Reese Witherspoon, uh, deciding to attend Harvard University to become a lawyer in hopes of uh, winning back uh, her dickish boyfriend uh, who split up with her not too long ago and in the process uh, 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 goes on a journey of discovery, makes uh, some uh, friends uh, slash uh, enemies and uh, the entire direction of her life uh, changes uh, for the better in a way. Everybody loves Reese Witherspoon, she's awesome and this uh, movie and role single-handedly put her on the map in Hollywood. Legally Blonde is freaking a... Um, Legally Blonde is freaking amazing. It is a beautifully made uh, masterpiece uh, and uh, by far uh, the uh, greatest uh, uh, rom-com uh, slash a teen high school movie uh, ever uh, to have been made. Uh, and uh, I don't know where Reese Witherspoon would be today uh, without this movie. Uh, Reese uh, Witherspoon is astonishing as uh, Elle Woods. Uh, she's flawless. Uh, she totally gives one well, the best uh, actor performances uh, in a uh, movie history period as uh, yeah per, and Elle Woods uh, has uh, now become uh, one of uh, my uh, uh, personal favorite uh, movie protagonists uh, yeah but I just wanted to be at uh, Elle Brooks uh, she's she's that's awesome everybody in her shoes and uh, my and her generation would want her to be her uh, uh, this uh, is uh, the role model uh, that uh, uh, aspiring uh, university students uh, deserve. Uh, had she made the mistake that she didn't realise uh, she was uh, making at first, uh, her life uh, uh, could have uh, turned out uh, uh, far worse, uh, but uh, thankfully uh, fate leads her down uh, the uh, correct uh, path, and uh, she uh, learns uh, throughout uh, her time at Harvard University uh, who she can trust, uh, who she can't. Uh, and even when she cries and has her challenges, uh, she thankfully takes it on the chin uh, and uh, is uh, capable of uh, staying uh, positive uh, throughout uh, this movie. Literally, whenever she steps out, uh, it's as if uh, she makes her uh, flowers grow and, and rainbows and sunshine uh, uh, follow her uh, uh, consistently. Uh, and uh, she uh, thankfully uh, doesn't uh, choose uh, uh, the uh, dude at the end uh, who likes her uh, for her body. She chooses the one uh, uh, who likes her for her personality. Finally, a girl uh, that uh, chooses uh, the right man. Uh, even if the apocalypse were to happen, she'd still be positive. She'd be like, uh, this planet is breathtaking uh, while it lasts. And as far as the soundtrack goes, uh, the uh, opening uh, song, uh, Perfect Day, uh, is a, a terrific uh, uh, entrance and, and builds up uh, the uh, revelation uh, of our uh, main character. As uh, for uh, the other uh, supporting characters and uh, performers, Performances. While they may be subpar in comparison to a Reese Witherspoon, they are uh, still uh, fabulous. And, and she develops some emotional bonds uh, with each of them, whether they be a friend or foe uh, for life. And uh, uh, Vivian, uh, thankfully, isn't uh, just a, a cliched uh, bully character. She's humanised. Uh, you see there is good in her and uh, she... Uh, and uh, uh, Ella may start out as rivals, but they gradually become best friends uh, by the end of the movie. And ladies, take my advice. Uh, pick uh, gentlemen like Emmett, uh, not to uh, scumbags uh, like Warner. My favourite of the supporting cast has to be a uh, Paulette, uh, Elle's friend from the beauty salon. Uh, the moments uh, with uh, Elle and uh, Paulette uh, are uh, uh, touching and and uh, hilarious at the same time. These scenes uh, elevate uh, Elle to being 
more likable when she uh, uh, helps uh, uh, Paulette uh, uh, get uh, back and form a compromise uh, with her former boyfriend. Uh, they're going through uh, a similar dilemma, and uh, uh, Elle's uh, uh, adorable uh, dog uh, is the observer and goes wherever Elle goes and uh, gets into the funniest shenanigans in the entire movie, and uh, uh, the uh, movie is uh, uh, surprisingly quotable, uh, uh, seriously, uh, quotes uh, like, uh, I don't need one, I'm going to Harvard, yes, uh, confidence, uh, baby, uh, with um, that uh, confidence, uh, Ella, you you could uh, uh, rule the universe. Uh, it's not only plenty of fun and perfect as a comedy, uh, but uh, it uh, knows uh, when to get serious, like in the... Uh, uh, segments uh, when uh, Elle's uh, uh, role model, uh, Brooke, uh, is put on trial, accused of uh, murdering her husband. Uh, Elle finds herself in an intense situation, and you're like, Elle, you are a badass. Uh, the moments uh, when she uh, finally uh, realises uh, that uh, uh, Brooke's uh, uh, husband's daughter uh, is uh, the uh, true uh, murderer of uh, of Brooke's husband and is uh, d uh, taken into custody. Uh, y and I'm like, uh, I have uh, never cared uh, uh, this much uh, in a, a, a rom-com uh, teen movie uh, ever. I love this movie so much, I don't have a one negative with it. So it's untouchable. It belongs in the library of a classic chick flicks along with a Mean Girls and Bridesmaids, but uh, Legally Blonde is uh, the greatest of those three. I, I'd uh, uh, favour it over Mean Girls since my one nitpick with Mean Girls was that uh, I wasn't a fan of the resolution of that movie, whereas the resolution with Legally Blonde, where when Elle has achieved uh, the perfect life, uh, that said uh, she deserves uh, that uh, ending uh uh, satisfies me to my core. It uh, deserves uh, uh, every bit of uh, praise uh, that it received on its initial release uh, uh, 17 years ago in 2001, and it's league superior to its inferior and cringe-worthy uh, follow-ups and spin-offs um, Legally Blonde 2 and Legally Blondes. I give Legally Blondes Five stars out of five best movie ever. Will my future girlfriend be blonde? Uh, I don't know. We'll see. But I'd love to have a blonde girlfriend, personally. Well, I love you guys. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. And what are your thoughts on Legally Blonde? Please comment and let me know. Please like this video and subscribe. Please follow me on Twitter and on Google Plus and on Instagram. And I'll see you next time when I'll have a special review of The Little Mermaid. And remember, movies are us. Bye, guys.